not be shield But well, we'll see how Az, um, Azazel does against that, since Zero Suit Samus doesn't need to cross you up to be super safe. Also, hi, Super Peas. Uh, they don't need to be super uh, cross-up heavy to be safe on shield. They can poke you with Zare. They can uh, land on you with things like Fallen Up Bear, especially on platforms. All of this incredibly safe. And Zero Suit can disengage with the best of them. And on top of the added power-up of... The oh, man, I got to bring this up. Metroid Dread. Okay. <laughs> that, because I know a lot of Bayonetta fans are very sad that our brothers, our brothers, I don't know if I'm going to call Metroid fans that, they, they got their game we haven't. That's not the point. Honestly, I'm really excited to see this game because I don't think people know this. I actually love watching Xerxes Samus because Xerxes Samus is so cool sometimes. Now, I know people don't think Xerxes Samus is like cool to watch. She's actually pretty horrible from what people have told me, but I think she's pretty awesome. I definitely loved playing her in P+. It's honestly so much fun to play her, even though I'm bad. That's not the point. We just love seeing, you know, how much people actually kind of just take a slow time when they actually play with this character, you know, making extremely good callouts because that's exactly what you need with this character to just do very well. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's definitely an awkward position that a character can be in because they can play, like, they can play aggro, they can be in your face, like, flip, kick com flip jump combos can, uh, can be really flashy. But one of the best things a character does is disengage. And if you're constantly disengaging, it means that uh, interactions can be lawn, they can be drawn out, and uh, kind of temperamental to say the least. But an early stock there, for, or closing out the stock first, is JJ Tails. And that's rather huge in uh, for any character against Zero Suit, because you do not want to let this character run away from you with the lead. And now, now we can start seeing Yoshi's tail start to snowball instead of just waggle. I mean, honestly, for sure, just because, you know, Zero Suit may have a lot of good tools in neutral, and she's gonna take that first stop with up smash right there. But, you know, PC, I mean, not PC, sorry. <laughs> we just watched him. JJ Tails actually kind of noticed that, um, you know, they wanted to actually jump a lot more, just kind of took advantage of that. Definitely going to be a little bit more careful they need to be, um, especially when getting to a lot of higher percents. Just picking and choosing when they actually want to jump, not really taking it for granted because doing it too much of something or too much of something can actually be really bad. So definitely for sure you need to watch out for that, like in the future. Ooh, that fast fall was almost incredibly dangerous, but a good scout on JJ Tail's part, just holding, uh, holding onto the roll read until it mattered. Still second stock, this will start to get a little bit hairy if he doesn't close out soon. I mean, oh my lord, that was a heck of a read. It looked like it was an attempted B reverse that was just missed, but hey, you take the Paralyzer whenever you can get it. Uh oh. Wow, he died. Oh. Absolutely. Like, that that tail die. is very strong. But definitely just scouting out that um, flip kick so. Just one of the many things, you know, CSS mains have to actually really be um, worried about. Just because, you know, a lot of these are not really, um, I would say, um, like easy to call out, but Ooh, that yes, was really absolutely good. for sure. Really nice is there to back air. Yeah, you, you gotta be on point with those. And having a nice raw killing aerial, super good against Yoshi, not trying to deal with that, uh, that double jump armor. I mean, I'm I've been surprised we've seen a boost kick come out uh, as much as it has. And it was only like a couple of times. Like why, like why go for a multi-hit that could be seen as inconsistent when you've got things like back air to, to scout out, though jump height can always be a little bit tricky. But hey, Yoshi's jump height is also that just as big. So hey, <laughs> you gotta save back air, might as well throw it out. And just like with these airs that, that have gotten Azazel the lead, thus far. Got to be careful with these eggs. And okay. wow, yeah, we're actually going to take that last stock. I mean, we definitely... mm -hmm. there. Yeah, that's the stuff. That's the stuff that I love to see, not only from Zero oh, Suit. Oh, absolutely. Uh, like Zero Suit players, of course, like, you got to like you've got plenty of ways to combo, plenty of ways to, to confirm into big damage. But fair one stuff is has been kind of super slept on over 
the preference of utilizing neutral air instead. And I mean, neutral air is crazy as well. But if your opponents are so afraid of one thing, then they're not looking out for a forward air, which not only is it really good rising, it's really good landing too. It's good stuff from Azazel to close out that game before it got uh, even more tense. I mean, absolutely. Now, they definitely just need to take this and kind of run with it because, you know, they did just kind of barely made it like back at the end there. So definitely one of those things where it's just like you need to be very careful about how you kind of approach this next game because you want to make sure you take everything that you learned in that first game and kind of just apply it better in order to kind of just make it kind of, you know, very convincing. Yeah, we'll have to see what stage they go to. Naturally, a stage like Battlefield uh, often favors Zero Suit uh, in just being able to find more places to land, more places to flip over to. Uh, I mean, I'm always Absolutely. on the train that Pokemon Stadium 2 is Yoshi's best stage, period. Oh, so absolutely. <laughs> if that's banned, uh, then Small Battlefield is equally a really solid start. Just Biplats in general are really good for this character. But we'll have to see what they go for. We'll have to see like what the process is. And even if they change character, I mean, I, I mean, it. honestly, I actually really love Battlefield as a stage just because other than, you know, um, their defensive options that you have at your availability, you also have a lot more aggressive options to your disposal um, when you're on Battlefield. But going back to PS2, now, as you said, this is definitely one of um, Yoshi's best stages. No, no, um, so definitely don't of, mind it. It one is of, the best stage. Not just one. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. No questions. I'm I mean, for it. sure. I, you know, no, I don't think I don't think I want to ask questions. We're going to have a little bit of a confusion if we do. <laughs> um, for sure, are we just kind of, you know, making it hard for JJ to land? Getting the up but definitely not going to kill just yet. Definitely need to, um, you know, find more ways to actually use their Paralyzer. That. I, we saw it there, but, but um, instant Paralyzer is not enough to combo into boost, uh, into boost kick. Oh, okay, he was really hunting for it. Kind of, I guess he was expecting an egg toss, as that would have been a really good punish, but just dashing around his JJ tails, and he gets massive damage because of that one overextension. Playing Zero Suit can sometimes be one. I guess literally in this case, walking on eggshells and <laughs> that Zara went right through the egg. Did you see that? Yeah, That's so crazy. <laughs> oh wow. Is that gonna kill no, not just entirely yet, okay, but that back air. Up. Yeah, that's a good chase. You gotta go out there and close <laughs> those stocks. Don't make Yoshi start to approach. Once and, Yoshi uh... starts to approach then everything will begin to fall apart for him because so much of his stuff is really good retreating. I Honestly, for sure. It definitely does kind of work out sometimes for Yoshi, but definitely needs to be a little bit worried about it. Um, definitely really enjoy how Yoshi, honestly, just as a character, takes a lot of space out of the air. But, you know, Az Azazel, Az I'm so sorry. Just kind of making that not really too much of an issue at this point. Definitely making a lot of the adaptions that they put to really good use. Yeah, Azazel, oh, the quick jab. Yeah, he's plus. You can't just be jumping out of shield. Oh man, it's been... It... Okay, this is kind of the game plan that you can expect once you lose a lead against Zero Suit. Just like any overextension can lead to a massive berry. That jump out of shoot will get caught, but <laughs> I'll stock up. That's so crazy. Oh, down, okay. Down throw into up smash, sure. I not mean, real. that was not real, but I mean, that up smash is very real. Up smash is such oh, a good move, please. I just love how, you know, they're really just like, walking all up in JJ Tail's face like it's nothing. They said, what are you gonna do? Try me, absolutely, and not gonna get that. I was very, very much waiting for that, you know, flip kick, you know, spike, but we don't get to have nice things in this house. Very uh, sad. And yeah, not quite yet. The, the angle was just a little bit off in order to get that spike, but hey, he's still like riding high with this, uh, with this, what is like a now a 40% lead and the stock. Okay, oh, absolutely. yeah. Absolutely. Very nice. 
I like that. I like that gambit that he uh, kept uh, kept going for once we see this uh, last stock. He's really making Jader Tales like start to consider like what can you do, uh, what are what are the options that you have in spots like these, and consistently JJ Tales would be throwing out something offensive at full stage. And the reason Zero Suit can be considered so good is that full screen isn't always safe. And we see it again, that flip jump just all the way across and closing it out with the back air. Like it's full screen is where Zero Suit just has so many so much of her tools, but her burst range is just as effective uh, as any of any normal fast character. Like it's it's insane how much control Zero Suit can have in any given moment. I mean, honestly, and we definitely really um, saw that a lot coming in from Azazel. You know, they were kind of just showing a lot of confidence that second game as compared to the first game where they didn't really have as much, you know, kind of just playing around. I think they kind of took some things from Mars. I don't know if anyone's seen that little Twitter clip about Mars just playing against, I forgot their name. 